Okay, micro uh, SDX stroke micro SDR. I've been asked this question so many times. Uh, will it transmit 11 meters? Will it do CB? Will it do like three bands, 27, triple five, etc., etc.? So I thought, you know, I'll have a quick look, I'll have a quick go, and uh, we can uh, see for ourselves and for once and for all. Um, I've got here a President Lincoln Mark I, currently set to 27 triple five. I've got the Micro SDX uh, set to 27 triple five. Um, I'm going through this power meter, HF power meter, uh, set of 30 watts, and into a homemade open frame dummy load, so it will transmit to a certain degree. Uh, the Lincoln is um, also on a dummy load. In fact, I'll show you these. They're both on dummy loads. Uh, the Lincoln puts out about 10 watts. Uh, that's what I had it limited to because I use uh, just just QRP on this radio on 10 meters. I don't tend to use 11 meters, and that one, as you can see, has got the homemade um, uh, dummy load. So we pick up the microphone for the uh, for the uh, uh, Lincoln, and there's the speaker mic and. Let's just give it a go. Is the micro SDX receiving me? Well, it appears that it receives 11 meters. Um, it's probably a little bit of overload, and uh, the radios are so close together. But um, it's yeah, it's reading uh, plus 10 between the two dummy loads. So it appears that it will receive 11 meters. Let's see what happens when I uh, talk to the Lincoln. Hello Lincoln, hello Lincoln. Yes, it appears that it will transmit on 11 meters and it will transmit a sort of signal to the uh, Lincoln. So there you go. Terrible, terrible quality. I'd, I would imagine there's what's going on here. The micro SDX, you've seen my other videos, I've only used it on 40 meters and 80 meters. I've got the TX drive, I've got the noise gate, and I've got my TX bias minimum and maximum set for those two bands. I've now chunked all the way from 40 meters up to 27 megahertz, or you know, like 11 meters, and I haven't adjusted those settings. The reason I haven't adjusted those settings is because I'm not interested operating that high at this moment in time. I'm only interested, let's turn the volume down on that. I'm only interested in 80 and 40 meters at this moment. You know, I want to get to grips with this little radio and I'm learning all of the time. You know, I'm experimenting, I'm uh, going through, or I say, it, just all of the settings but what i don't want to do is be racing backwards and forwards between 80 meters 10 meters you know 15 meters bouncing backwards and forwards and uh, what i'm trying to do is methodically write down all of my settings uh point to point to point now for 11 meters it doesn't interest me it does interest me but it doesn't interest me on this radio i haven't i mean i use the lincoln for 11 meters if i need it and other radios for 11 meters as if I need it but those that know me know that I don't generally free band etc you know I use 10 and 12 meters 15 meters I've got no real need to go on 11 meters just for the odd f opening and the summer and winter sporadic e you know uh, to, uh, I'm quite happy to be on 10 and 12 meters for that you know 11 great fun band I do like to listen on it uh, very very rarely will you ever find me transmitting on it but that's you know that that's not the topic of discussion now the topic of discussion is will the micro sdx transmit and receive 11 meters yes now it sounded terrible on the lincoln because i haven't adjusted the tx um, bias minimum and maximum or my noise gate or the tx drive i hadn't adjusted it for 11 meters but as you can see it will transmit 11 meters it will transmit audio in the upper sideband on 11 meters it will also receive 11 meters once again uh, the, the two radios are very very close together 
Um, they're both on dummy loads, and uh, the Lincoln's on a shielded dummy load. I say the the STX was on a um, was on uh, my old own open framed uh, dummy load that I built back in the nineteen seventies. So so th there is the answer there, uh, ladies and gents. Um, yes, it will transmit. It will receive on eleven meters, and I'm sure that if you adjusted all of your settings for eleven meters. On the micro SDX stroke micro SDR, I'm sure it would sound great. I've had nothing but good reports on 80 meters and 40 meters since I adjusted my settings properly on those two bands. And I have no reason to believe that it won't be as good up there on, um, on 28 and uh, 24 megahertz. You know, I've got no reason to believe it won't be. I know the power is reportedly drops off higher that you go up the band. You know, it's just the nature of the beast. It's all part of this experimentation. It's all part of this, uh, you know, will it work, won't it work? Well, I've now done a very basic test for you. You have to take away from that what you will. I'm not going to go any further. I'm not interested in using that little radio on 11 metres. At the moment, I'm using it on 80 and 40. And when I get round to it, I'm sure I'll be using it on 15 and 10, you know, and places like that. But, you know, I'm oh, what I don't want to do as well is wreck it. I don't want to break it just because, you know, I'm testing for someone else. That, I don't mind the testing, the brief test that we've just done, but uh, that that's it. That, that That's all you're getting from me as regarding 11 metres. The, so the question is, will it transmit and receive on 11? The answer is, upper sideband, it appears to. Uh, the settings were probably completely wrong for the band, so therefore, you know, the audio didn't sound good on the transmit. And you've got to bear in mind as well, uh, you know, the Lincoln may be a nat here off frequency i'm not going to sit here now or stand here and, and sort of fine tune everything you know it, it doesn't interest me but i hope that uh, you, you'll take this information away and you can make your own informed decision i'm not saying buy one for 11 meters i'm not saying that at all i say you pay your money you take your choice you know it's an experimental development radio it's not a plug and play out of the box free band or CB radio, you know, it is a tool. Um, whichever one you buy, whether it's you know the Chinese, the Chinese knockoff of the Chinese knockoff of the Chinese knockoff, you know, there's so many out there now. Whatever one you buy, uh, you know, you, you pay your money, you take your choice. So I'm not saying that buy this, it works brilliantly on 11. I'm saying. It appears to work on 11 metres, free band, stroke CB, whatever. But, um, you know, you're going to have to play about with the settings. And um, good luck with that one. Cheers.